tens of millions of dollars in damage. That's the result of a stubborn fire at a marina storage building in St. Clair Township near Sarnia. The fire at Koopman's Marina in Port Lambton broke out just after 7 a.m. Nick Paparella has more. The thick, dark smoke could be seen for kilometers. Every available firefighter, 65 of them from five different stations, were called in to deal with this large storage building, which housed 65 boats, at least four exotic cars, and some jet skis. The St. Clair Boathouse on Old River Road was engulfed by flames shortly after 7 a.m. Police have warned area residents to stay indoors because of environmental concerns from the thick black smoke that keeps billowing in an easterly direction. Because of what's burning in there, it has fiberglass boats, the boats have gasoline, the resin comes off of it, there's motor oil in it. Bob Murphy lives in the neighborhood and he was told to take precautions. Turn the furnace off and everything so that we're not sucking all this air into it and just don't know anything yet about the sort of fallout from all the toxicity, what's going to happen to the home. The Ontario Fire Marshal is on scene and the Ministry of Environment is also on, on hand here. They have been working very closely with St. Clair Township Fire to make sure that they are taking care of all the issues for the environment that may come around. The storage unit contained boats that were 38 feet and larger, ranging in value from about 300000 a pop up to 750000 Now if you do the math, that adds up to about $40 million in boats alone. That $40 million probably isn't going to be too far off. It's, uh, it's going to be fairly extensive. We, we did manage to save the building beside it, which has exactly the same fire load in it and the same amount of boats in it. It's hard to say what to do about it now. Stu Kraft drove in from London once he heard about the blaze. He lost his 42-foot cruiser in the fire. Don't feel too good about it, but uh, what can you do? As long as nobody got hurt. Todd Thompson's 32-foot boat was being stored nearby, but outside the shed. Nevertheless, he's never even had a chance to enjoy his toy. I've never had it in the water. I bought it at the end of the season for next year, and here I sit. Maybe some dreams just aren't to be true. <laughs> the cause of the blaze is still being investigated. No one was caught inside the building, and there were no injuries. In Port Lambton, Nick Paparella, CTV News.